All right, hello, my name is Griffin Paul. I'm a co-founder at Burrow Components. I'd like to take you on a little journey back in time to my freshman year. This is me on a Friday afternoon. I didn't have a car, so I needed to go to the store to get a couple 12 packs of sodas on my bike. <laughs> As you can tell, the situation looks pretty precarious. I've got two fingers on the handlebars, two on the boxes, the cardboard's ripping, and I'm just praying for no bumps in the road. So at this moment, I really wished that I would have had a better way to carry cargo on my bike. And it turns out that I'm not alone. So in 2014, the US Census um, rec reported a 60% growth in bicycle commuting in the last 10 years. Now that's a lot of people, and that's fantastic. But how are they carrying their stuff as well? What you can do is go out and buy a brand new cargo bike. That carries a lot of stuff. But also, it can cost a lot of money. And what happens to the old bike that you were once riding? It probably still works. Some of them end up gathering dust in garages or just plain old in the landfill going to waste. So a lot of people, including myself, make do with what we have and ride the, our existing bike. But simply tolerating this problem wasn't enough and I decided there's gotta be a better way. So I searched the market and I found a lot of options to carry cargo, but None of them really fit my needs. A lot of them were too low capacity, too expensive, or just plain old didn't fit my bike. And so, but also, my bike isn't that different from many others, so I knew a lot of people were having this problem. So what we've done is set out to create a new cargo solution that fits on any bike and can get, them back, get existing bikes back on the road carrying more. Our approach is designed to keep dollars in your pocket and bikes out of the landfill. So I'd like to introduce the Burrow Rack. It's our contribution to a larger repair, repurpose, and recycling movement going on in the bicycling industry. And with the Burrow Rack, you can teach your old bike a new trick by turning it into a safe and convenient transportation tool. It's perfect for your grocery run, carrying pizzas, your gym bag, you name it, the Burrow Rack can handle it. What we do is we use a small 20-inch BMX wheel. We get your cargo down low, and that um, gets a low center of gravity and makes for a safer and better handling characteristic on your ride. It's lightweight and can carry up to 50 pounds, as well as it fits on almost any bike. And something that we're very proud of and that is um, the case with not very many products on the market is that it works with suspension forks. So why go out and buy a new cargo bike when you can upgrade the bike that you're already riding and allow it to carry more? So what you do is you simply take off the front wheel of your bike mount the dropouts to the fork on the bro rack, clamp the fork blades, and you're off ready to ride, completing your errands, getting stuff done. Not only do we want to make your bike carry more, but we want to make it safer. That's why in our package we're offering the bro rack, a 20-inch BMX wheel, and a powerful disc brake. We're not just selling a product here, we're selling a lifestyle. And we've seen a lot of momentum gained in the market this summer, actually. A uh, Kickstarter was successfully funded for another conversion that converts your bike into a cargo bike, and that's the lift. What it does is convert your bike as well into a cargo bike, and it carries more than the bro rack, but it costs much more as well. We've been, um, they've, they've raised over $100,000, and it's a great success story, and we're using it as our motivation and to gauge our market. Right now, this is where we're at. We've come a long way in the hothouse. We've built 15 prototypes and our current design's patent pending. We've got 10 beta testers out on the road giving us constant feedback on our design. And here's a picture that one of them sent us. He said that without the burrow rack on his bike, he would have been unable to carry this large, bulky package home safely. It would have been blocking his view, made his bike unstable, could have fallen. Also, with minor social media marketing in, over the last month, we've captured 13 pre-orders as well as a retail, an interested retail location. Moving forward, we're going to Interbike in Las Vegas, Nevada. Awesome, right? Um, in two weeks, it's uh, North America's largest bicycle trade show. And while we're there, we'll be looking for sales leads, press coverage, and a manufacturing partner that can um, build a quality rack. This fall, we're gonna launch a Kickstarter campaign to crowdfund our first production run of the Burrow Rack. And by the end of the year, all the small changes to make our design utilitarian and manufacturable will be done and we'll be able to start working on new products. 
In the spring of 2017, we will be ready to ship the first run of products to our faithful backers. So our team consists of Ricky Riedel, who's back over there. He's a Cal Poly alum, does manufacturing design and analysis for us. I'm working on marketing, sales, and finances. And our very helpful, invaluable lead mentor, Eric Meyer, who's been bringing strategic and branding advice to the table, as well as regional, local, and international connections that we never would have made otherwise. Also, we'd like to thank all the other help we've gotten from the numerous people over the summer. You've been so invaluable. So what we need now is more sales referrals and leads, press coverage and contacts, and any people that are, ex are experts in these categories to take this project to the next level. So if we can complete those, those goals, we'll be ready to make more bikes that are already out there carry more and keep them out of the landfill. So come by our booth, we'd love to talk to you. Thank you so much.